All right, uh, this is the tutorial for Woodwork, the acoustic version by Knuckle Puck. Uh, it's in open C tuning, so that is uh, C, G, C, G, C, E. All right, so the G and the E don't change. The rest of the strings have to be detuned, and the chords are super easy. You're going to start on the fifth fret, and it's 5-5, five, five, open, 5, open, open. All right, and you take that exact same shape and you slide it up to the seventh and then down to the fourth. And those are the chords for the intro, the verses, and all the chorus parts. All right, so you can listen along to the song to figure out the pacing. The chord transitions are slightly different between the intro and the verse and the chorus parts. Uh, the only difference, the only change here uh, for, as far as the chords go is for the outro. So the outro starts at the 7th fret, drops down to the 5th fret with that same chord shape, and then you take your finger off the low string and you play 5-4. Alright, so all together it sounds like this. When you, when you play that, try not to like really emphasize that low uh, uh, six string because it'll muddy the sound. So you're just kind of brushing past it and focusing a lot onto that fifth string. Uh, but you, you do play it. Uh, in the same vein, when you're playing these chords, your low string is tuned so low that it's flimsy and very easy to bend. So be careful that you're not bending the sixth string when you're playing these chords. Otherwise, it's going to make the chord sound incorrect. Um, so that's uh, that's everything as far as the chords go. The rest of the song is all these little riffs that's ha that happen. Um, so the first one, it starts on the 5th fret, 5th string, and then the open 4th string underneath. So what that is, is you can look at my strumming hand. So it's open and then the 5th fret, and then I'm releasing the 5th fret as I come over to do this transition, which is the 4th string, 2nd fret. So it's, uh... And that there is just a hammer-on from the 4th to 5th on the 5th string, okay? There, that's just the high note, which is the seventh fret, fourth string. You could also play the third string open. It's the same note. Uh, so whatever sounds better, whatever's easier for like the tone of your guitar and your ability level. Um, so then it changes to uh, to this, which is just kind of the same thing, but you add in a fourth fret, fourth string. So it's a. She doesn't transition to the high note there, just does that like four times, uh, which is like a little hammer out on the fourth string, fourth fret. And then uh, back to what we already know. So the, okay, so that's second fret, fourth string, hammer on four, five. And then as it ends uh, in the intro, it does a. Uh, so that's that fourth string, fourth fret, and then up to the seventh fourth string seventh fret fourth string again third string open works the same way so that's a and that's you know it's preparing to go into the verses and then it goes into the verses and the riff changes same shape but you're up here on the third uh string fifth fret and it's a uh, So I'm playing the second string, second fret, and fourth fret, and then a hammer on. All right, so it's just between the third and second string. Sorry. Um, and uh, and that's that's it. And then that transitions from there into this. So that's just um, fifth fret, third string, open second string. Slides up to the ninth fret. Down to the fourth fret. 
and then there's some alternate picking there and then it break and it pauses and then goes back to the fifth fret so it's like a little bit of alternate picking a little bit of playing the two strings at the same time and the guitar at that point is uh so from here on out i will try enough so there's like that pause there that's the point of you pausing in the riff there's like a that little little rest um and then uh before it transitions back into the verses it does this part uh so you're playing uh you're playing the third string fifth fret second string seventh fret and then the fourth fret on the second string and then this is a which is just four or five open. Um, so you could play that. And again, you could also play that with the uh, third fret on the uh, uh, first string. Whatever's easier. I mean, you have to skip a string here, but the fingering is a little easier and it might sound better on the tone of your guitar. So, and then same, so same thing, uh, just a different way to play it. And then it goes back into the verse, which we already know. back up to this the only difference now is when it hits the outro um, and when it does it's playing playing this it's uh, it's, uh um, and that's so the chords are doing So when it does the on the riff at the same time you're doing so that's just five four and the rest of the riff is so second fret hammer on and then the five four it's actually not a hammer on it's a pull off but and uh and that's it. Um, so that should be all the parts. Um, if you have any questions or anything, you know, let me know. Leave a comment. But uh, you should be good to go from there.